<laughs> Darrell Jazz Johnson, Gospel Herald, City Sports Report.com. I'm here with New York Knicks legend, Mr. Anthony Mason. Anthony, how you doing today? I'm good. And yourself? Great, thanks. First off, uh, did you make any New Year's resolutions for 2015? Just take life, you know, take life as it comes, you know, take your blessings, stop blocking your blessings, you know, being mad at, at things that you can't control and just living life easy, man. I got my kids and they doing well and I'm just enjoying my family. Yeah? Now you you opened up a business in, uh, with uh, John Starks. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, actually, I got a couple of businesses, but me and John have a pizza restaurant in Harlem, 123rd in Manhattan. It's doing very well. Uh, you know, you put John's name and my name on anything in New York, I think it would do well. Plus, I've been in the insurance business for the last three years with the whole talent group. We're on 42nd and Park, trying to get these athletes and people to make better decisions, you know, stop ending up on these shows like Broke and stuff like that. So that's been a lot of fun. Who was the first person that came to you during your playing career uh, to talk to you about making better financial decisions? Because that is something that's, that's very much needed for, for professional athletes. Well, you know, it's funny. My agent, Don Cronson, was great at it. I didn't listen. I was like, yeah, yeah, whatever. Defer this, do this. I was like, yeah, sure, whenever. And, you know, I went through a little financial bad times, you know, but I'm, I, you know, with, the blessing I have is I'm marketable. So when I got into my insurance business, I got a lot of New York fans, a lot of people opened their doors for me, and my business is taking off. So I was one, I'm a story that doesn't happen all the time. So what I would tell my advice to guys is not before you even think about doing something with your money is become a good person, be a personality, people that be somebody that people want to deal with after your career, you know, because that's that's be the people you might have to count on. You know how many people I see in the city? You know, I, used, I went to your basketball camp when I was little. They CFOs and CEOs and all that now. So just be a good person and you never know how it comes back around. So that's my advice even before worrying about what to do with your money. Final question, Westchester Knicks just started playing basketball. Have you been up there uh, so far this season? And if so, what was your experience? Yeah, I was at the opening game. Um, what I, I've always liked about the well, what I liked about the CBA when I played and the teams under the NBA, those guys are hungry. You know, they want opportunity. So you're going to get competitiveness every night. You're going to get guys diving on the floor. You're going you're gonna to see that. If you're a New York fan and you know basketball, that's what you want to see. You want to see people diving and, and going hard to try to get to the next level. So I enjoyed it. All right, thanks a lot for your time. Always good to see you.